Hello Skeletons, it's Disney Queen Skelly here and this is a brand new playlist called Disney History. So basically I'm going to be tackling the long gone Disney shops, attractions, what have you, um, pretty much from opening day 1955 to literally I think like 2015 or 2016. So let's get into it. The first thing we are actually going to talk about today is the Hollywood Maxwell's Intimate Apparel Shop. This shop was around from 1955 to 1956, and let me tell you why. One shop you'd probably not expect in Walt's original Disneyland is a place to buy bras, lingerie, and torsolettes. But when Disney had opened in 1955, there stood the Intimate Apparel Shop, presented by the Hollywood Maxwell Brazier Company of Los Angeles. Not only would you purchase unmentionables there, but you could learn the immodest history of under things in the shop's modest museum. The shop's genial host was the Wizard of Bras, a merchant a mechanical figure that gave a recorded lecture on, on underwear. Some Disney historians say the Wizard of Bras was the earliest Disneyland robot, though it wasn't, the sophistic it wasn't as sophisticated as later audio animatronics figures. The intimate apparel shop was on the east side of the street, just beyond the Silhouette Studio, while all the other shops on Main Street fronted against the build to line. The Victorian facade of the intimate apparel shop was set back from the street. It's the only shop on Main Street with a front porch. The shop closed in January 1956 after six months in operation. The door was sealed in 1959 and is now locked and unmarked. The space of the shop once occupied is now part of the china closet next door. The porch still offers a bench and two chairs where you can sit, rest, and watch people go by. And that is it on Hollywood Maxwell's Intimate Apparel Shop. I hope you enjoyed this first ever Disney history video. Um, I don't know what we will be tackling next time, but I hope you keep your eyes open for it, and I hope you enjoy this playlist. Bye, little skeletons. Stay safe. I love you guys.